Hello everyone, welcome to Code Enzyme. This is the 17th video of the series Graph Algorithms for Competitive Programming. And in this video, we are going to discuss this problem from the CAC's problem set that is planets and kingdoms. Now, the prerequisites of, uh, of this video will be the would be the previous video that is the strongly connected components. Now, if you read the line, uh, the problem statement uh, a game has n planets connected by m teleporters. Two planets A and B belong to the same kingdom exactly when there is a route from A to B and B to A. So basically you can visit from one to another vertex and one vertex to another and another vertex to back. So that, that exactly means what strongly connected component is. And your task is to, is to determine for each planet uh, its kingdom. So just the previous uh, code will work I think. So what I, can, I will do is actually I think I, I still have that code, code with me. So this was the code for the previous problem and I will tinker this a bit to find the strongly connected components. Okay. So let's say this is the input. Okay. And the expected output is something like this. Okay. Now, uh, like, okay. I think the, the part till topological sort will remain same. Uh, so we have the topological sort now with us. And now I just want to find out the components. So I will need a SCC component. So what I can do is let's say int color. So I will change this a bit. So let's say I also assign a color to this and let's actually make this a SCC of vector vector int. Okay. So we have this or maybe I can make a map of it. So let's say map of int comma vector int, right? And I will call this SCC. And now I will say like, okay, uh, why is it giving me errors here? First of all, let me remove this. I comma I, I will like, I, I will say, I will, I will say like this. Okay. Let's say I comma I. Uh, I think it is because I, I did not specify int here. Okay, now we have this. Now I can say uh, the color will remain same. And uh, what I will do is SCC of color dot pushback node like this. So I will have several strongly connected components and their colors. But uh, will this actually work? Uh, I think I will say like vector int. Uh, let's define something like uh, kingdom of uh, n plus one. Uh, okay, okay. Once I have found all the strongly connected components and their neighbors, like once I have this, what I can do is uh, let's just remove this right now. And uh, now I will have all the strongly connected components. Let's say debug of uh, this thing, uh, debug of uh, SCC. So what does my map actually look like? Uh, I think I forgot to include the debug template. Yeah, so my map lo looks like one is connected with one, three and two and four is connected to four and five. So four and five are in separate kingdom, which is given it here like this. And one, two and three are in separate kingdom, which is given. Okay, we have something like this now. Uh, or maybe uh, maybe what I can do is uh, let's say uh, what I will do is uh, let's make a vector int of SCC of n plus one nodes. Initially, it is zero. If I do that, let's say uh, I will simply say color of node equals to that color. So I can say SCC of node equals to color. So if I do this, what am I getting? So I'm getting a one one four four four. So I think this is also correct. Uh, I think this is also correct. So can I print the same thing for different cities or do I actually need to print only two here like this? I'm not sure. Okay. Let's do one thing. Uh, let's say int color equals to zero and uh, or let's say color equals to one and here I will do color plus plus. So I think this should work. Let's run this. Yeah, now we are getting this and I also need to 
I need a count of the strongly connected components, right? So let's say int count equals to zero. Uh, I think I will say like int count equals to zero, and here I will say count plus plus. So this will give me the count. So this is giving giving me that the count is two. So first of all, I need to print the count. And after that, I want to go from one to n, C out, color of i with a space, and I think this should work. Uh, not color, sorry, SCC of i. So we're getting two one one. Uh, so I think this is the correct output. Let's remove the debug lines, and let me remove this. Yeah, is this working? So yes, it is working. And now let's try to submit this and see if it works. Yeah, actually, I was not prepared for this video, and I just uh, I thought it was an easy problem, and I just uh, uh, did it like that. So I got stuck. I struggled a bit, but uh, Okay, so that is the code and I hope you were able to understand it. I will give the link of this code in the description uh, or maybe in the pinned comments. And next thing we will discuss the giant pizza problem uh, and it uses a very nice concept called 2sat. Uh, so we will see that. Okay. Um, so thanks guys if you watched it. Now let's move on to the next problem.